If you inherited a house with two other siblings and you need to pay them, but you have money for Hajj, what comes first? There's no first and second and third. Your, your, your responsibility when you are by the means to go for Hajj is opposed to go for Hajj. When you have inherited, you, by, by, by mere fact that you need to pay them out, doesn't make you to say, I must, I must go for Hajj first and then pay them out, or I must pay them out now and use my Hajj money. That, there's priority. If the one that is not, it's not you, somebody, the other sibling want to buy the house, you also will be fair and give them the right to buy the house. Because if I passed away, I can't make it a rule that the house must go to one son and you pay the others out me. Preferable, we say one son, yeah. But you as a deceased person doesn't have the right to make that one child for you and give the house at the, at the cheap price and the others be paid out actually giving the others a smaller price or a smaller share from the inheritance. But your question is, what comes first, Hajj or, or paying them out? Debt paying out will be a debt on your, on your, on your share forever. For you going for Hajj, also that, that debt will also be there. If afterwards you did not go for Hajj and you had the money at a particular time, Allah Ta'ala says, uh, was ever by the Hadith of Kudisi, was ever by the means of going for Hajj, and it doesn't go for Hajj. Fala ubali in matter Yahudian or Nasranian. I don't care whether he die a Christian or a Jew, because he was by the means to go for Hajj, and he did not go for Hajj.